This has got to be like one of the busiest anchorages I've ever seen. Caught up. Uh, I'm just out here having some orange juice. So I'm gonna take Lenny for his walk, his morning walk. He's pretty excited. Austin's washing out his new water jugs that he got at the uh, store the other day. We found a hose here, so we're going to fill them up. And then we'll have a bunch of extra water on top of the water tanks that are in the boat. So we're just doing a little update. We sailed to uh, from Kors to Sardinia. Um, we, we're just going to stop here just for, uh, literally just for the day. Um, stay overnight and then leave the next day just so we can like go up for dinner in Sardinia, whatever, just say we came to Sardinia. Um, because we don't really have much time, we just have to start making our way across France. Um, but we got here and Lenny needs dog food. Uh, he's almost like he's running low. We thought it would be easy to get dog food, but um, it's actually been like really difficult. Like, there's no, there was no dog food stores on course no pet stores like it was fair I'd find places that sold like the like type of dog food that he needs um so we're actually we're on Sardinia and we're actually we're gonna leave and we're actually sailing um 35 miles right now to a bigger city further south so in the wrong direction because we have to get some dog food for Lenny and we know that there's a store here that sells dog food um Grocery stores sell dog food here, but it's like, it's really like, it's just like, um, either it's like the store brand and it's something like random, or it's um, like just like a really like cheap one, kind of thing, like a Purina and something. Um, uh, but with all of his health issues, we're kind of just like, I just don't want to, I don't want to like switch him on to something crazy. Um, with all the medication he's on and stuff right now, so um, yeah, we are sailing. Sailing now to let's see here. Olbia? Olbia? Anyway, so maybe maybe if I'm lucky we'll get one last I've gotten big into juice lately. Like, I'm just constantly drinking juice. So this is like, I'm always got a juice on me now. My new fun thing. It's so pretty here in uh, Sardinia. It's all mountains and uh, like big cliffs and everything. But there's all kinds of islands off of this island too. So there's like so many little nooks and stuff. Beautiful, and it's cooled down um, now a lot now that we're in September, and uh, the temperature is great. You're not like super hot during the day. It's kind of just like nice. Uh, Cors or Corsica was the same way though. It's uh, very mountainy and stuff. But here it almost seems like in Sardinia it almost seems like more, like more sharper, steeper cliffs. 
Hey, babe. Hey. You guys snoozing? Aw. Lenny doesn't like when it's windy. He always snuggles up to Austin. Tonight we're staying at Free Docks. There's tons of ferries here in this big city so we can go get Lenny's food. Then we're gonna get pizza. It's actually a really big city here. These ferries are huge. We've got a Ferris wheel over there. Hopefully it's a good night. So we got Lenny's dog food at the place. Ooh, it stinks. We got Lenny's dog food and um It took me forever to uh, pick one. Austin was getting really mad. But this store had like literally like every single kind of dog food you could possibly imagine. Um, and it had the kind that we have them on already, which is good. It's hard to find. Good thing we brought a cart. Now for the long walk back. We also got a bunch of like cookies he likes and stuff. Um, he's been so picky, so he really likes this stuff. So we just, I've been trying really hard to find this stuff. So it's uh, awesome that they had it there. They have one bag of it, but the store was huge. I just haven't been able to find any like big like pet food stores or like dog food places. Um, they just sell like, like little stuff in the grocery store, but it's usually like the store brand or something. Lenny is so picky, he's not going to eat it, so. Our boat is actually out over there, like just straight across this bay. But it would have taken us like, whatever, like it's, it's like right there. But because there's a big bay here, we had to walk around this whole entire bay um, and cross this bridge to get over here. We're almost back at the boat. Austin, are you going to the marine store right now, or are you going after we stop at the boat? No, no, I have to go after. It's closed for lunch. I think we're going to get a thunderstorm. You can hear the thunder. It's very dark over there. I'm at the laundromat doing laundry. Um, Austin was going to a hardware store. He doesn't have a phone. Well, we've been like one phone. So he left and then we had left all the windows in the boat open because Lenny um, is in there. So we left it all open. And uh, as soon as Austin left for the hardware store, like 15 minutes later, it started like torrential downpouring and I can't leave because I have all the laundry here. And I haven't heard from Austin. Austin isn't back yet. It's been like two hours. Um, so I'm really hoping that he went back to the boat and closed everything, or it's been really wet inside the boat. We got all the machines going. We had so much laundry, it was crazy. Austin came back, closed the boat up. He said it's soaked inside the boat now. I so I I uh, dried it all up though. And poor Lenny was in there all getting rained on. And he came with fries. Mmm. That's pretty good. Laundry's not dry. So last night we got uh all the laundry done. And uh this morning we are just gonna Go, we'll pick up a flag I think we gotta get a Monaco flag and a Spain flag and then uh, we're gonna head out see how far we get Going maybe back. a new Canadian flag too ours is a bit ripped now yeah it didn't last very long this season yeah it it's like torn like right in half but we have like bags and bags okay so I'm probably gonna have to
to start hand washing laundry again because like all this laundry we did and it was 30 at least 37 euros like i don't know exactly how much it was because i'd keep popping stuff in coins in the dryer but um way too much money so like 37 euros is like 55 dollars canadian so like that's way too much to do laundry so i'm gonna have to start washing off the back of the boat and we're off it was a nice uh almost it was two nights almost three days at a free dock which is always awesome free public dock. yeah great No swell, no ocean swell, because we're way in here, so it's nice. The city was called Olbia. Olbia. It's a lovely day today. We have like just between like 10 and 15 knots of wind and it's coming at a beam there's so many sailboats out here today i don't know if you can see them all in the distance but there's like a stupid amount like hundreds and hundreds of boats like just like sailboats just like right there hundreds. yeah hundreds hundreds <laughs> okay maybe like a hundred why how many probably, you were probably like 20. no sit and count them sit and count there's one You're wrong. And there's more, I just can't see them. How does that feel? Hundreds. We're actually ripping today. Like we're just sailing. We're doing like 6.7. 6.8. Wow. That's pretty good. Our boat usually won't do more than five. Yeah. So that's pretty good with just the sails. There's a super like old school wooden ship over there going by. And it has five sails up right now. It's crazy. We have a lot of work. Maybe they're doing something today because another big giant uh, wooden one, wooden uh, sailboat is going by us now and it's got all five sails up too. It was good. It was good at first, but... What was your last red Oh, I don't know. We got to our anchorage for the night. Austin's having red wine. Yep, and take Lenny for a walk at that beach. It's nice in here, it's so sheltered. It's like super calm. Nice, good change from mainland. <laughs> 